Care needs to be taken to try to understand what's happening inside of the shaft. In a number of ways, this, this water issue has to be dealt with. Hidden beneath the misty shores of Oak Island lies a mystery that has captivated explorers for generations. From whispers of pirate plunder to the temptation of ancient secrets, this small island off the coast of Nova Scotia has captured the imagination of treasure hunters worldwide. For almost two centuries, explorers and adventurers have tried to stake their claim to the treasure without any guarantee of success. And now, brothers Rick and Marty Lagina are determined to unravel the mysteries of Oak Island once and for all. Look at that, right there. Wow, those are big beans. They are. Oh, yeah. And no two are the same. It's impressive. Yeah. Armed with cutting-edge technology, they have embarked on a mission to unravel the mysteries. And along the way, they have encountered a possibility that could potentially rewrite history. The legendary treasure could be located within Aladdin's cave. But what secrets will be revealed by exploring Aladdin's cave? Are we on the brink of solving a centuries-old mystery? Or will Oak Island continue to guard its secrets? The stakes have never been higher. So, before we go ahead and explore the Aladdin's cave, make sure you have subscribed to our channel. Press the bell icon so you don't miss any updates, and let's dive into it. The historical significance of the garden shaft is deeply intertwined with the legend of Oak Island. Since its discovery by European settlers in 1795, the reputation of the island has been surrounded by whispers of speculation. Discovered in the 18th century, the garden shaft is assumed to be part of a complex system of booby traps and flood tunnels, originally constructed to safeguard the fabled treasure of Oak Island. Its very existence points towards the ingenuity, or perhaps desperation of those who sought to conceal something of immense value. In recent years, the Lagina brothers have focused on investigating the shaft systematically, aiming to uncover the primary flood tunnel system protecting the money pit. Renovation efforts on the shaft have primarily focused on stabilizing its structure to ensure safe exploration without risking collapse or further harm. This is a very interesting area to all of us. So we're going to put the inducting camera down in KL 14.5. The team has employed advanced drilling techniques, sonar mapping, and underwater robotics to probe its depths as well as the surrounding areas. The most significant obstacle is the water infiltration, which has been a persistent issue of its own. But the team has some ingenious solutions up their sleeves, from fast-setting urethane to freeze-walling techniques. They're pulling out all the stops to keep the water out of the tunnel. Speaking of recent discoveries, let's talk about the jaw-dropping moment when they uncovered the secret tunnel. The team hit the jackpot through a mix of historical research and cutting-edge technology like ground-penetrating radar and strategic core drilling operations. And get this, it's right next to the money pit. The team has been digging deep, using carbon dating to trace the tunnel's origins back to the 17th century. This just falls in line with many theories about the Oak Island treasure's origins, sparking further debate on who might have buried the treasure originally. The revelation of the secret tunnel is a game-changer in the Oak Island treasure hunt. Not only does it validate historical accounts and legends regarding elaborate engineering works, but it also hints at the involvement of powerful figures with vast knowledge and resources at their disposal. Moreover, dating the tunnel to the 17th century places it within a period marked by piracy, exploration, and colonial expansion in the Atlantic world, adding layers of historical context to the mystery. This newfound knowledge opens doors to endless possibilities. Could the treasure be linked to notorious pirates, ancient rituals, or even indigenous peoples? Exploring Aladdin's cave was no easy task, requiring expertise of divers, historians, engineers, and archaeologists to focus on areas with the highest potential for discoveries. Advanced tools like sonar mapping are helping the team in charting the tunnel's course and the cave's dimensions, making it possible to identify key areas for investigation. 
The murky waters were illuminated by special lighting equipment, ensuring clear visibility for the cameras. So right now we're at 87 feet from the top, mm -hmm. so we've gone down about four feet roughly. Right, but how far is that down there? Uh, it's not very much further. I'll just open this up, this little hatch here, so it gives us a better idea. As the exploration began, the remotely operated vehicles were sent into the cave first, assessing conditions and ensuring safety. They transmitted images of a massive open space exceeding expectations, and the initial visuals hinted at an extensive network of tunnels and chambers yet to be discovered, preserved in the cold, dark depths of Oak Island. The sheer size and scale of Aladdin's cave suggested the sheer amount of effort that must have been involved in its creation, hinting at a purpose far beyond simple storage. As the team ventured further into Aladdin's cave, the beams of their lights began to reveal the outlines of potential man-made objects. These initial discoveries provided intriguing glimpses into the past. In the shadows, the spotted shapes resembled tools, structural elements, and possibly inscriptions etched into the cave walls. Each finding offered a potential clue in the Oak Island puzzle, and the initial findings included tools of unknown age, fragments of wooden structures and carved stones. Historical and maritime archaeologists meticulously examined the recovered artifacts, comparing them with known artifacts to establish a timeline for their usage. Look at Lillian, this is... Mm -hmm. That's kind of weird, eh? I mean, that is unbelievably linear. The fragments of wooden structures underwent carbon dating, revealing their origins in the 17th century, possibly part of the original construction within the cave or remnants of containers. This timeline coincides with the development of the money pit and other documented activities on the island. Among the objects found within Aladdin's cave were intricately carved stones bearing some symbols, which could be linked to the Knights Templar, Freemasons, or other groups historically known for their secrecy and rumored treasures. The origins of the objects found within Aladdin's cave and their connection to the Oak Island treasure have been the subject of intense speculation, practically reviving the quest. The revelation of the treasure's location within Aladdin's cave has breathed new life into old theories while inspiring fresh hypotheses. One prevalent theory suggests that the Knights Templar, a medieval Christian military order, created the underground structures on Oak Island to safeguard their treasures, possibly including the Ark of the Covenant or the Holy Grail. This theory is supported by the discovery of symbols within Aladdin's cave believed to be of Templar origin, hinting at a connection to the order's renowned architectural prowess and their enigmatic disappearance in the early 14th century. We should be inside the cave now. You can see silt kind of moving past there. Well, I'll just take her down incrementally. Okay. Another theory suggests that pirates, including the infamous Captain Kidd, used the island as a cache for their loot. This not only aligns with the timeline of piracy in the North Atlantic, but the network of booby trap structures on the island also adds to the credibility. The theory regarding the involvement of indigenous peoples has prominently featured the Mi'kmaq, local to the Nova Scotia region. These structures might have been built as part of ancient burial practices or for storing communal treasures, with their alignment to celestial events supporting indigenous construction methods that often incorporated astronomical knowledge. Some theorists even suggested that the structures on Oak Island could be remnants of pre-Columbian transatlantic contact, potentially involving Norse explorers or other European adventurers predating Columbus. Speculations aside, it is only the carbon dating of wooden artifacts and analysis of metalwork that can potentially narrow down the construction time frame by indicating the creator's technological level. Now that the treasure location has been identified, the immediate next step involves a detailed and systematic excavation of Aladdin's cave. This phase will employ an interdisciplinary approach, integrating archaeology, geology, and cutting-edge technology. 
Additionally, the team intends to expand their exploration efforts to include previously unexplored areas of the island. However, the road forward is filled with challenges, both known and unforeseen. Apart from the issues with stability of the shaft, the team also faces the challenge of managing expectations, both their own and those of the global community eagerly following their progress. The anticipation of significant discoveries must be tempered with the reality that not all secrets yield treasure and some mysteries may remain unsolved. The psychological and financial pressures of such an undertaking cannot be underestimated, and the team's resilience and determination will be put to the test like never before. As for Rick and Marty Lagina, the discovery within Aladdin's cave represents the culmination of years of effort, dedication, and an unyielding belief in the mystery of Oak Island. Apart from the possibility that the island hides material treasure of significant value and historical importance, the discovery embodies a deeper quest for knowledge and understanding. Therefore, the implications of this discovery reach far beyond the personal triumphs and glory of the Lagina brothers. Each artifact only adds to a growing body of evidence that challenges our understanding of history, making us question what we know about the island's past inhabitants, their motivations, and their capabilities. As the excavation of Aladdin's cave and the exploration of Oak Island continue, the legacy of this treasure hunt will be defined not just by what is found, but by the spirit of discovery that has propelled it forward. The true treasure of Oak Island may ultimately lie in the journey itself, but for the Lagina brothers and all those fascinated by the Oak Island mystery, the adventure is far from over. It is merely entering its next, most exciting chapter.